Now, we explore the presence of prodigy level talent in a different area. By different area, I don't just mean location. I meant a different part of the brain. Take music, for example. Artful, abstract. It's believed to be processed in the right side of the brain. I don't know, I just heard that somewhere. I forget. But what about something as abstract as memory? See, memory comes from temporal lobes behind both sides of the brain. Now let's go find out more about it from our memory master. I'm Jemaya Lambunau and I'm a memory athlete. I'm Coach A.B. Bonita. I'm Jemaya's trainer and the head coach of the Philippine Memory Team. I began when I was 11 years old when I was in grade 6. But first I was just um, training for just like study purposes when I was in grade 4. It was a bit um, hard because my mind was so um, new to different things. The reason why I enrolled in my coach school was because my grades were um, going down because my memory was so um, low. I enrolled for two summers and then that's when my coach found potential in Initially, I was also a memory athlete, so uh, I joined the group and then later on uh, found um, other individuals who do the same thing. And then later on, um, we started to uh, develop different techniques that can only be used not just in studies but also in sports. Dito sa memory sports is just a new sports in the Philippines and ang mga ginagawa namin dito is nagme-memorize kami ng numbers, words, um, dates, deck of cards, or yung shuffle deck of cards. So, I will show you kung ano yung iba't ibang mga example materials namin. We have binary numbers. So, binary numbers is just composed of ones and zero. Yung mga memory athlete natin, um, kayang mag-memorize ng hundreds of binary digits in just a few minutes. We also have um, numbers. Merong short digit numbers or yung mga mabilis lang na memorize or long hour numbers. So dito, binibigyan lang din yung mga players ng few minutes para tandaan as many numbers as they can. Abstract images, dates, random words. So ito yung isa sa mga malaking na itutulong, hindi lang sa athletes, even sa students. Kasi yung random words, you're supposed to memorize it as well in just a few minutes. The audience can write down anything in this. Uh, in these fields and then pwedeng i-dictate lang kay Jamila yung mga salita so hindi niya nakikita yun and then later on i-recall -re niya yung mga salita perfectly in order. Another demonstration could be the human calendar. Kaya niyang sabihin yung exact day of the week from uh, 1582 to year 9999. So that's the Gregorian calendar. Kung gusto niyo malaman yung birthday niyo or a year in the future pwede din. And lastly, the uh, memorization of deck of cards. So ang gagawin dito sa shinafold na baraha, after shuffling the card, ibibigay natin to later on kay Jamila. And then she will just uh, she will memorize this card in just a few minutes using this timer. And after memorizing this, i-set aside natin yung card. We will give her the ordered pack. So, i-duplicate niya yung shuffle deck of card dito sa ordered pack. And then, sabay natin siyang bubuk bubuksan later on. Good day, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for joining us for this epic memory battle. Today, we are joined by two memory goliaths on my left. She is one of the youngest international masters of memory. At the age of 13, she made the cut. Also, 2013, she broke three world records. Please welcome Jamila Lambunau. <laughs> and on my right, her competitor, Nemesis, greatest arch rival and enemy. This guy can dance really well. Tricky, icky. Very good. Now is the time for us to test your memory skills. First game is the memorizing the numbers game. I will be saying 10 numbers. You will be saying them back to me after everything is said and done. Ready? Go. Seven, three, two, five, nine, zero, zero, six, two, one. Ready? Go. Seven, three, two, five, six, zero, zero, nine, two, one. Yes, 
She got it all right. You got about Perfect. two or three. Nice. Okay, very good. Jamila gets the point. Game number two is paper. Is the actual random words game. Ready? Go. First word. Helicopter. Glossary. Testicular. Maleficent. Perpetuity. Jurisprudence. Tensile. Booty licious. Quack. And number ten. Boom shaka like a boom. Ready? Go! Yeah. Helicopter. Helicopter. Glossary. 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 Testicles. Testicular. And, uh, drunk. Maleficent. Uh, yes. uh, Testiles. Yes. Bootylicious. Yes. Quack. Boom shaka laka. There you go. You didn't even get boom shakalaka. <laughs> you just got boom. Uh -huh. It's too bad for your memory, mate. And now it's time for our final test. I will give you guys 10 cards each. You have 10 seconds to look at your cards, and then you will recreate your cards in the exact same order using the gold cards. Ready? Go. Time. Now. Ladies first, Jamila, please recreate your cards. I like the gold cards though. Yeah. You think they come in silver? No, I think they come in bronze. I think I like them played. You know, played. Played? Mm. Mm. Okay, very good. You gave me a joker. So we forgot to mention that every mistake on the card game means that a finger will be lost. I lost once. Mm. All right, okay. I will open your cards. <laughs> Whoa! I like, I want you to do it like what she, how she did it. Because it looks nice. Okay. Boom! 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 Did you, you didn't even get a single one. <laughs> no, I got a single. It's just the different orders. I think you even went overboard with the number of cards. Okay. There you go. Hey, finally, another champion has been crowned in the first ever Boga Memory Games. Congratulations, Jamila. Hey, high five. For you, you get away from yeah, me. Yeah. Oh, I'm ashamed of you. Up next, I take a little math into our favourite game. 